Shaver 1000 here. Today we got some more yard sale stuff. Uh, just a couple little things. I thought I'd do a quick video. I know some of you guys like that. So, got some stuff over here. I'll show you. Monkey got a couple things. And uh, so, let's see what we got. Okay, guys. So, uh, first of all, Monkey got this. It's cute. It's got like a little candle in it, but it takes a battery. It lights up. So, she thought that was cute to hang out at uh, um, Halloween time. Got the spider webs on it. I thought it was cute too. So, she got that. This was at another yard sale though. Um, she got three of these. Uh, I gotta hang one up for her over there, and then two is in her mom's room. So she got these for two bucks a piece. This was at another yard sale. They had one of these um, electric grills. It was from T File, and uh, there's no box or anything. The grill itself was in good shape, but this thing looked like it'd been in somebody's garage for 10 years. That's no joke. She had 10 bucks on it. I was going to offer eight. I said, you know, can you do any better than that? She was like, well, you know, it's in perfect shape, except for the dust. The dust is free. Nah, I, I think I'll, I'll keep, I'm, I'm just, I just want to get 10 out of it. For $2, you let a sale walk away. Okay, whatever. You can tell, I don't think it ever been used because of the way the grill was. The grill was perfect, but the outside of it was nasty. I mean, nasty looking, just full of dust. And, you know, so I'm like, you know, it's it, it's clear that you've never used it. And it's clear you haven't, you're never going to or you wouldn't be trying to sell it. So, you know, apparently, and it's, it's almost 3 o'clock right now. This was probably about one o'clock nobody offered you anything on it yet fine I just walked away you know well uh, that's when monkey bought these three of them two bucks a piece I thought that was a pretty good deal but then monkey said well you want that grill and I'm like nope <laughs> the woman looked at me like you know after that she could have said you can have it for a dollar and I still would have walked away because it's a matter of principle I mean if you're sticking firm on ten dollars at a yard sale you should put twelve or fifteen on it because people's gonna try to talk you down you know so anyway I just thought that was stupid you know oh well she could at least you know ask what my offer was gonna be you know I was gonna try to get it for eight you know but anyway this was at a different place but the other items like uh, this thing so she got this and I got a uh, I got a knife sharpener here. It's from uh, it's Presto. It's called EverSharp. Let me get my glasses on here. <coughs> they had five dollars on it. Um, electric knife sharpener, EverSharp. It's from Presto. There's four four slots. So I'm guessing one and twos for each side of this blade it's a coarse blade and then this is a finer blade three and four for each side so we're going to do a review on that they had five dollars on that they didn't have a price on this and i also got something that was pretty neat it's old not super old but um logitech it's for your pc it's for an older pc i don't even know if it can run on mine but I just thought it was cool because I don't think it's ever been used and I'll tell you why because it comes with the comes with these and this has never been open I don't know about this but this has never been open so it's still got the number on it this has still got the number on it it's from Microsoft I thought you know maybe we will see if it work if it'll work on my computer but I don't know this is called Sidewinder. It must be a game. I can tell you that, that's probably never been used. Uh, if it if it was, it's, it's hasn't been used much. Um, do not make illegal copies of this disc. <coughs> I just thought it was pretty neat. 
you know, maybe somebody with an old older computer. Now they had ten dollars on it. So um, been in a warehouse for a while. I've seen it last few times we've been down there to buy some things off these people and I was like, you know, I'm just going to go ahead and get it and clean it up, see if it does anything, if it works, you know, maybe resell it. If not, it can go in my collection, you know. Uh, it's got programmable buttons and stuff. I thought, you know, like I said, if anything, it could go in my collection of tech stuff. I know it's not a camera, but it's still, it's still kind of cool. Um, but they had $10 on this. And like I said, I don't think it's ever been used. Um, it's still got the plastic cover on the USB thing, the USB cable there. Um, they had ten dollars on this, and we went up there with these three items. Thought there was something else. Anyway, monkey had this. So these three items: the sharpener, this thing, and that game controller thing, which I know nothing about. I know it it goes. Uh, it, it doesn't go past like. Like, I don't even think it's compatible with Windows 10. I don't know. But, so, you know, they were, they wanted 15 just for these two items. For the sharpener and, and that game controller. Um, I said, well, because she had these. And she said, what do you guys got there? And we showed her. And she said, um, what do you give me for odd stuff? <laughs> I was like, 12 bucks, you know. She was like, that's fine. So, I figured if this works, I'll probably keep it. You know, we can always use the knife sharpener, right? Well, I mean, I know it works. Uh, I did plug it in there. It's real quiet, and it does spin up nice. I just don't know how well it sharpens. So we're going to do a video and see how well this sharpens compared to my crop stick over there. Um, so, you know, if it sharpens pretty good, I'll just keep it. Um, so you can remove this plug to clean it. I don't know how old it is, um, but like I said, it is a Presto. It's a model eight zero or zero eight eight zero 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 one. You know, I'll look all that up when we do the uh, when we do a video on it. it's eleven amps. So I just you know I like old stuff. I mean, it's not antique by any means, but it is older. So I like stuff like that like this like I said this is just cool just because it, you know it looks it looks cool you know I, I haven't seen one before I know nothing about it so uh, twist handle oh you can twist the handle too cool but just just kinda kinda neat so I just wanted to share that with you uh, I think that's all we got so but yeah she really liked this I thought it was cute too so that would be cool she wants to hang it outside there uh, where we got the big bulb hanging now so um, of course around trick-or-treat time I noticed the other day uh, a set of rope lights like the red ones we put out front a set of those but the, it was black and I was like what the hell is this I didn't remember seeing them before and she said oh that's for Halloween I was like what and I plugged them in their orange lights I'm like I didn't know you had these she said yeah I've had them for many years I was like wow so we'll decorate a little bit for Halloween next year. But anyway, guys, uh, again, I want to say thanks for watching. Thanks for joining me on this. Um, we may make make a video of this. You want to see a video of this? Uh, yeah, I might as well, right? Because um, it's kind of cool. Like I said, I don't even know if it'll work on my PC. Um, I was reading somewhere in here where, you know, what it was for. But... 3D Extreme 3D Pro. Like I said, I don't know. Uh, it may be cool just to have to keep around, but if not, I'm sure somebody can use it. I got to make sure that you don't have to activate them things in order for it to be used. If you got to activate them in order to use them, I don't know if that's going to be any, you know, if that's going to have anything to do with anything or not like I said this has never been opened here so um, it must be the software to run this yeah it is extreme 3d pro twist handle joystick it 
Sheesh. Insurance people call me three, four times a day. They start at 8 o'clock in the morning and they don't quit. Okay, so it's USB. Here it goes. Windows 98, Windows ME, Windows 2000, and Windows XP. So it probably won't run on mine. But I still thought it was just, it's just cool. You know, 2004. <laughs> I do have an old computer though. Monkey's got an old computer that I have in the garage that uh, I need to get some capacitors for it. And we're going to do that together sometime when I get the caps for it. And uh, maybe we can run it on there and see. But like I said, you know, there's the the pin number. and uh, So, I don't know. Um, it should, should be fun to check out anyway. So, work, play, communicate. So, I, I'm not sure, you know. And this, I don't know. This must be a game. Sidewinder game device software. So this is software. It includes uh, profiler, activator, editor, and drivers. Uh, Microsoft Windows 95. I just love this old stuff, guys. I, I could tell when I seen it, it was old. But what got my attention is it's never been used. So I don't even know if I want to use it. Some people might collect this stuff. Do you guys know anything about it? Do you know if people collect them? If you do, please let me know in the comments below. I just thought, you know, if somebody didn't want it, I, like I said, I, I keep it just because I like to get my toys out and look at them once in a while. Okay, guys, so, all right. Appreci again, appreciate you watching. I got a light blinking. Must be memory card. So, we'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks again, guys, and uh, we'll see you soon. Shea Bear, Myth the Man, Legend, I'm gone for now. Don't forget to check out Monkey 1000 channel. Give her channel a visit, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye, guys. Take care.